So as we continue to go through these lessons, we're gonna start going from simple to more intermediate to more advanced prompting. And now we're gonna actually start going into crafting prompts. So let's check this out. These are some practical everyday prompts. And I put together the top five in this PDF. So outlined below are a series of practical prompts and frameworks that you can use in daily life and ideation. These are really designed to provide a practical prompting framework for individuals seeking to enhance their productivity and creative output. So we have our first brainstorming new ideas. So this is a formula that you can use anytime you wanna brainstorm new ideas. Same with the copy generation. These prompts are formulas. When you create a prompt and you craft it, what you're doing is creating a formula that's repeatable, that's going to always give you the desired output for that specific prompt. So if we take a look at our formula, we have, I'm looking to explore a specific subject in a specific format. Do you have any suggestions on this specific topic I can cover? And some examples of this are, I'm interested in creating an Instagram page that covers travel. What ideas do you have on topics I could include, such as budget-friendly destinations and hidden gems to visit? Next example, I'm working on a newsletter that focuses on technology. Can you recommend topics that would be engaging for my audience, such as the latest gadgets and software updates? So let's go ahead and grab one of these and paste it into ChatGPT. So with our prompt, I'm working on a newsletter that focuses on technology. Can you recommend topics that would be engaging for my audience, such as latest gadgets and software updates? Boom, here we have a list of 10 topics that are technology focused for my audience. And prompts you can also build on top of as well. All the prompts in this PDF, you can remix and rearrange to be specific to your use case. So I could even add in my audience, details about my audience, or just use the prompt as is. So now let's move to our copy generation prompting formula. I'm interested in this type of text that highlights the benefits of this subject. Please write this number of pieces of copy for me on this subject. And our examples are, I need an email campaign that showcases the features of my new product. Can you write one for me on the ease of use and affordability of the product? The next example, I'm interested in a web page that outlines the benefits of my coaching service. Could you write one for me on the personalized approach and proven results of my coaching program? So let's go ahead and paste in one of these examples and see what ChatGPT comes up with. I really like this type of prompt because it's so flexible to really almost any type of copy generation. You can change this formula to be specific to almost any field of work. So here is what ChatGPT came up with. We have our initial outline for our coaching service. We have our intro here, we have our personalized approach, we have our proven results, we have what you can expect, and a little bit of a call to action at the end. So this is a perfect output to get us off the ground and really kickstart the creation process. So let's go on to the next lecture where we go into more everyday prompts.